and I jumped, I put my beetle boot foot on his shoulder and vaulted up on the stage and rolled onto the stage and he looked at me and there was this moment of silence. I couldn't hear anything except his voice went in a thick Liverpool accent. How you doing, Cobber? Seemed like he was happy. Hello, everybody. This is DJ Jerry. In June of 1964, thousands of screaming fans paid up to $3.70 to see the Beatles on stage at Melbourne's Festival Hall. As the band was nearing their final song called Long Tall Sally, 19-year-old Brent McOslin diverted the police's attention by asking a pretty girl to run up to the stage ahead of him and distract the cops. There's a cordon of cops shoulder to shoulder kneeling down in front of the stage about three feet high. There's a very attractive girl that I know. She was sitting to the left of me. I said, look, when I go like this, you run down the center of the aisle go, waving your hands and distract the cop. Well, Brent, this young John Lennon look-alike, leaped onto a policeman's shoulder and launched himself onto the stage with the Beatles and shook hands with the man who shook the world, John Lennon. And he did this in front of thousands of Beatle fans. This hand is the hand that shook the hand that shook the world. John Lennon held out his hand to see Mr. McOslin and asked him, How are you, Cobbler? Brent felt connected with him. He said, I didn't feel like an invader. That must be destiny, huh? But seconds later, police dashed onto the stage to grab him. And as the band came off the stage, they noticed that Brent was trapped against the wall by the police. Paul McCartney gallantly told the police to let him go. Brent thought the cops thought that he made them look stupid. But when Paul McCartney told them to let him go, it was like Moses parting the waters. They just had to let him go. Well, this is DJ Jerry reporting a Beatles story that you may not have heard before. But don't forget to keep on listening to the Beatles and keep on rocking. Bye now. It'd be awesome if you'd like this video, hit the red subscribe button, and turn your bell notifications on so you don't miss out on any weekly video.